Hey everybody! Time for another St. Matthew's Church's thing. It says here, Premonition! Have you ever had a feeling or premonition that something was going to happen before it happened? I think everybody has. Generally that's called common sense. Someone jumps off a bridge, oh they're gonna die. They probably mean something more cosmic, though. More impossible. As usual, here we have... This is like their magazine. This... I think these might actually be the main collectible, uh, as far as these things are concerned. Like, with Peter Popoff, it's always the, the trinket, but I think with these, it's, it's the, the little magazine. So that's kind of interesting. And here we have two Elijah meal cakes. Mm. Enclosed are your two meal cakes for your 40 days and 40 nights of blessings. Uh, let's see. Symbolic of what the angel brought to prophet Elijah. Your instructions in Bible faith. Before sunset today, eat one of these meal cakes and take seven sips of water. After sunrise tomorrow, eat the second meal cake, wafer, and take seven sips of water again. So, this is the first edible thing I will have gotten from any of these con artists so far. Here we have, oh yeah, the, those of you who are Catholic, like I used to be, will recognize these. They look just like the little Catholic wafers. And is that it? Yep, that's it. Is that all? I don't know if I'll be keeping these. I, I try to keep as much of this as I can without it cluttering up my space too much. But, I don't know. They're sealed in plastic, so maybe they won't get smelly. Here we have the business Reply mail. Always good. Complete with print your name and address and all that fun stuff there. And, okay, so this one is fairly simple. Then it's just the, uh, let me fold this over so I'm not doxing myself. The usual letter. Uh, we feel directed by the Holy Spirit to pray again for your financial miracle blessing. You are entering the 40-day season of, of blessing. Hmm. On your 40-day covenant of supernatural blessing page, write your name three times, representing the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Then write the most important things you want to come to pass within the next 40 days. Okay. So, these are wish magical wish-granting uh, wafers. Uh, you might remember the last video, if you watched it, that... Um, uh, I was given something, uh, something to put on the window or something. <laughs> you might remember better than I do. And that would make my wish be granted. Let's see, and then he wants, let me fold this over. Dear St. Matthew's Church's Prayer Family, I followed the directions with the two 1 Kings 19, 5 through 8 scriptural sacred meal cakes in faith, as instructed in this spiritual letter, and now I'm writing my name three times for the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. So there we go. There's all that lovely fun stuff. Um, these are the needs I'm facing over the next 40 days. I desire God's double portion blessings released in my life and my needs. In other words, I'll donate double the amount of money. I want to quickly, I need this double portion of God's blessing to relieve this financial need. <laughs> I need to give you money to relieve my financial needs. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm requesting prayer for a prophetic word. It's got it in, in quotes there, if you can see it. With the divine guidance I need concerning this personal matter. Enclosed is my biblical seed harvest blessing of blank dollars. Yeah, they're still pushing that. If you have misplaced your harvest plan, check here so that we may send you a new one. Never be without God's Biblical Seed Harvest Blessing Plan. Never! I might actually fill this out um, 
and tell them that I lost it and have them send me another one? <laughs> Wouldn't that be funny? <clears throat> and here it says, And he, Elijah, arose and did eat the meal cakes and drink the water and went in the strength of that meat forty days and forty nights unto the mount of God. So they're saying that these are supposed to sustain me for forty days and forty nights. I mean, I don't think they're literally saying that. They're just... They're saying they'll sustain me um, financially, if that makes any sense, which of course it doesn't. I am putting God first, <laughs> God first, and not myself, not my own uh, financial needs, and sowing blank dollars as my seed f uh, in faith toward God's blessing harvest. So, right here, uh, we put many things on our credit cards, put God first as the seed in your credit card today. Yeah, they're saying, um, give them money before doing anything else. And they are targeting people who don't have that much money to give, just like Pop just like Popoff. At least that's how I interpret that. You may interpret it differently, but I believe your interpretation would be wrong. So there we go. That's all I got for you today. Catch you next time for the next, probably more uh, St. Matthew's Church's stuff. <laughs>